What we have observed is a pattern that ISIL is taking people closer and closer to Mosul City. Initially, they had moved them, moved a lot of people into Hamama Lalil, and then they started moving people from Hamama Lalil closer to Mosul City. We also have reports that they are putting people very close to their offices um, and to military uh, installations, to what would be military targets. Now that seems to support the assertion that they are planning to use these people as human shields, as well as to make sure that the area is heavily populated with civilians to frustrate a military operation against them. They are also killing some people that they are abducting, uh, especially uh, people who formerly belonged to the Iraqi security forces. In the early hours of yesterday morning at around 1 a.m., uh, ISIL brought dozens of long trucks and minibuses to Hamam al-Alil city, south of Mosul, in an attempt to forcibly transfer some 25,000 civilians towards locations in and around Mosul. We understand that most of the trucks were prevented from proceeding towards Mosul due to coalition aircraft patrolling the area, and the trucks were forced to return to Hamam al-Alil. However, some buses did reach Abu Saif, which is 15 kilometers north of Hamam al-Alil city. We have grave concerns for the safety of these and tens of thousands of other civilians who have reportedly been forcibly relocated by ISIL in the past two weeks.